Dear July, I've lived through a short part of you this year already. This summer, you will be my most event-filled month. So even though your heat exhausts me, I'm still glad you're a summer month. I have been looking forward to you. To me, July means ice cream, pools, and bonfires. July, when you leave, that means school is right around the corner. Please don't leave. You bring good vibes, and that's why you are my favorite month. I'm scared of the fires you can cause in your sweltering, bone-dry days. But on the days you give us a nice, cool breeze are the best in the year. I love you and will miss you when you leave for the year, Mr. Roman Emperor. I'm afraid of moving from San Francisco to Lake Tahoe. I'm excited to go to sixth grade and to get my braces off after camp. I'm very sad I'm going to have to leave this camp in eight days. I'm also very happy we're far from leaving. There's something different about you. You're no June, so no end of the school year excitement, and you're not August, so no cramming in the last bits of fun at the end. You're just there, and that's okay. You're at the time to stop. The time to get our white shoes dirty and cry to new music and stay up till 3 a.m. talking to friends because we have a whole lot of feelings and because we don't have a morning alarm set and we won't for another month and a half. So, I know you're just there, but that's what we want you to be. You're the only month in the entire year when I am completely free. No school, no work, no stress. And I can't tell you how amazing that is. When I'm trapped in April or May or even June, I think of your hot days and starry nights of all the campfires, sleepovers, fireworks, and more barbecued food than I should probably eat. In case nobody's ever told you this July, you make a mean hamburger. While I'm excited to be growing up, I often wish I could return to a perpetual July, where my only worries are a sunburn, the price of a movie ticket, and what flavor ice cream to order. Thank you for all your warmth and love. July, I'll see you next year.